Hi, this is Presh Talker. In this video, I'm going to explain a weird way that you can multiply numbers known as the Egyptian method or Russian peasant multiplication. The interesting aspect is that you will be able to multiply any two whole numbers as long as you know how to divide numbers in half and double numbers. So let's do an example of 13 times 24. The method involves four steps. The first step is to take the number on the left and repeatedly divide it in half until you get to the number 1. So we'll take 13. When we divide that in half, we get 6, and we'll ignore the remainder. When we divide 6 in half, we get 3, and when we get divide 3 in half, we get 1, and we'll ignore the remainder of 1. So the first step is to take the number on the left and repeatedly divide it in half. The second step is to take the number on the right and keep doubling it. So the number 24 when doubled is 48. Then we're going to double this number again to get 96. And finally we double 96 to get 192. The third step is to modify our table by crossing out any row that starts with an even number. In our table, only the row that starts out with 6 is an even number, so we're going to cross out the entire row. The final step is to add the numbers in the right-hand column. So we need to add up 24, 96, and 192. And when we do that, we get the result of 312, and that's our answer. 13 times 24 is 312. Let's do another example to see how this method works. Let's say you wanted to do 16 times 26. The first step is to divide the number on the left in half repeatedly. So dividing 16 in half, we get 8, and then 4, 2, and finally 1. We take the number on the right, and we repeatedly double it. So from 26, we get 52, 104, 208, and 416. The third step is to cross out any row in our table that starts with an even number. And in this table we have a lot of even numbers. So we cross out the first row, the second row, the third, and the fourth row. The only row that remains is the last row, and so that's our answer, 416. And in fact, 16 times 26 is 416. So the short reason this method works is we're doing multiplication in binary. The long answer, I provided a link in the video. Description. I hope you liked this video. Please subscribe to my channel. You can catch me on my blog, Mind Your Decisions, or on Twitter, at Presh Talker.